Welcome to Spice and Pens. Subscribe to our channel for our recipes weekly. Hi and welcome to Spice and Pens. Today we'll be cooking braised pig trotters or otherwise known as lu zhu jiao. Before we start cooking, please follow us on our Instagram and Facebook page in order to know what we'll be cooking next. So let's start cooking. Now I'm using a non-stick pan from Shogun by La Gourmet to pan fry the spices as well as the pig trotters. Let it heat up, add in some oil. Swirl the oil around. Put in two pieces of cinnamon bark, two pieces of star anise, one teaspoon of white peppercorn, as well as half a teaspoon of clove. I am also adding in one full bulb of garlic skin on. But make sure you wash them first. I'm also adding in four pieces of sliced ginger. You can use young ginger or old ginger, it doesn't make too much of a difference. Just move them around and you'll start to smell a very nice fragrance that's coming out from all the spices. Lower down the heat a little to medium or low heat. Otherwise, the peppercorn will start popping and flying all over the place. Okay, when you can smell all this very nice fragrance that's coming up from the spices that we're using, it's time to put in the trotters. Be very careful when you put them in. I'm using two, so I'm going to pan fry one by one. Just put all the rest of the spices to the side. And just put braise one side, or rather, pan fry one side for about two minutes or so. The important thing when you are having pig trotters, make sure that you remove all the hairs. I'm using, most of the time I'll be using a shaver to just shave them off. Of course, if you want it in small pieces, you can always ask your butcher to actually cut them up for you. Use this here. Now, one of the reasons why I'm doing this is I want the oil from these uh, beautiful spices to actually go into the skin absorbed by the pot itself After this is done, I'll continue with the second one Move them around a little bit because we don't want to burn the spices or even the pork trotters I'm using the front leg of the pig It's less fatty as compared to the hind leg But if you prefer a fatty part, then of course you can go for the hind leg this cost me around eight dollars per piece like this. Singapore eight dollars in the wet market. Okay, we are almost done with the first piece. So when it's done, we'll just remove this from here and we'll continue with the second one. I'll be using a pressure cooker to cook this dish so that this can be done in a very much shorter time. The spices that I fried just now, I've placed them in this pressure cooker, putting the pig trotters. Add in 10 grams of rock sugar, one piece of bay leaf, two cups of Chinese rice wine, half a cup of light soya sauce, and one cup of dark soya sauce. I'm using the superior grade kind of a dark soya sauce, so it's not very salty. Just scrape everything down. and top it up with water, yes. covering the pork trotters. Just add a little bit more to cover the pig trotters. This will be just good. If you notice, I did not add in any salt at this point of time. Um, I would like to taste my braising sauce later, just to make sure that it's salty enough or sweet enough. And then I can add them. Now when this is done, we'll just put the lid on, turn on the fire. When you see steam coming out of this pressure cooker, I will reduce the heat down to low and let this boil for 40 minutes. If you do not have a pressure cooker at home, you can use a normal pot, but you need to cook it for at least 1 hour 20 minutes to 1 and a half hours. I'll see you back in a while. The pig trotters are done, let's have a look. Be 
beautiful. Look at how beautiful the color is. We'll just give this a taste. Mm. You can really taste the cinnamon bark, the star anise, everything inside here. But I think we need to add a little bit of salt to it to enhance the flavor even more. Just going to add in one teaspoon of salt. And just give it a good stir. And we are ready to serve. And ladies and gentlemen, this is how we cook our braised pig trotter or lu zhu jiao. I hope you like our video. Do click like on our video and do subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.